I'm finally back. And I know you're like, where have you been? It's been so long. I, I, I honestly don't know. I've been doing other things, but we're back. Uh, the channel is about to go boom. Okay. Uh, we, we've, we've been doing some things in the advertisement area and it's about to blow up. I can't wait. But anyway, we're going to use what we got here and we're going to play some 60 seconds. Wait, so welcome to the Astro Citizen program. 60 parsecs. It's a different one. In order to ensure your comfort during your stay on the space station, please adjust the settings of your cabin. Uh, resolution 1920 by 1080. Is that not an option? There we go. Massive volume. Let's put it about there. Alright, next. Ooh, pick an astro cadet. Dee Dee looks kind of crazy. I'm gonna pick Dee Dee. She looks weird. Alert, nuclear, nuclear apocalypse imminent. Executing order, see, I can't read. Ex executing order 1961, the new protocol initiated. Commence astro citizen emergency, emergency drill and brace for nuclear impact. Oh boy, what does that mean? I'm not seeing anything. Where is the nuclear impact? Sock puppet, alone in space. Meet your new best friend, proudly endorsed by the Astro Citizen medical staff. Is this like a loading screen or something? Am I supposed to click on something? No? What's going on here then? Okay, I have no clue what... Did you see that? It's supposed to be like this. Like that. That's how it's supposed to be. There we are. All right. Is this like a loading screen or? What? Oh, there it is. I'm like, what's going on? Welcome to I Sarah's 13 Space Station, Astro City. Are you okay, dude? <laughs> Look at Dee's face. Oh God. She looks like a drug addict. I'm just gonna be honest. She looks like a drug addict. Grab some soup you need to ration to survive. Oh god. Alright, uh, soup. Drop it in escape shuttle. Where is that at? Where's the escape? Oh, what the heck? What is she doing? Where's the escape? Oh, there it is. Drop. Find some medical supplies. Oh god, what, what the? Why is everyone on this ship has lost, completely lost their mind? And, and the, ash, the asteroid hasn't even hit yet. Like, what is going on? What the heck? I'm glad I didn't choose Emmett. Find some medical supplies. I don't have any. We're all gonna die. This lady, these people, oh my God. We're all gonna die, okay? Can I just announce that? Uh, everyone, um. We're gonna die. I don't know how else to put it, but we're all gonna die. Where is the medical supplies? I don't, what does it look like? I don't know. Let's grab some soup. Is that medical? I can't grab soup. Great. What is the medical supply? Oh, is that it? Oh crap. Oh, I see it. How do I get over there? In here and then in here. Oh, I see. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. All right. Find the handbook. Excuse me. The handbook. Uh, he definitely got it. Cause he's obviously doing it wrong. So that means he doesn't have a handbook. Who has the handbook? Oh, is that it? No, it's just a regular book. The handbook. Right, the handbook. Oh, there it is. She said these students have the problems. All right, I got this. Oh, shoot. It's good. Find some crafting resources? Is this Minecraft? What the? Oh, this thing. Put it in the escape shuttle. Bam. Find a crewmate. Oh, God. Does that mean we have to pick through these people? Oh God, they all have issues. They all have issues. I'll take her. She thinks she seems like a good leader. <laughs> alert, alert, alert what? Wait, do we need to escape? Incoming missile, hide. 
Risk of impact. Oh god! Grab whatever you can and head for the escape shuttle. Oh shoot. Here come soup! Grab the soup! You need a lot of food. Do we have any water? Oh, there's a gun. Get the gun. Oh, I have to drop all this. Ah! Drop it all. Alright, get the gun. I need that gun. Got the gun. Uh tape? I don't know why would we need tape. Oh god, this is so scary. Oh, let's take this guy. I can't, I can't take him. Oh, to the shuttle. Ah! Alright, let's take you. Come with me, sir. Jeez! This is insane. Let's grab the shovel, some more soup. Uh, you? I can't take you. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Run, run. I'm, I'm getting you! I'm trying to get you! Let's go! I can't deal with this. It's too much stress. I don't think- I, I grabbed a lot of soup. At least we won't go hungry. Jeez. This is a lighter. Oh wait, it's another loading screen. Okay. Come in, Astro Citizen. Light to the galaxies. Come on. I thought I said come in. Okay. Oh god, so if you guys didn't see the other Astro, not Astro, what am I talking about? The other 60 seconds, it's like a, it was a prequel to this game. Uh, basically, it was a nuke coming in, and yeah, it was a nuke, yeah, and you had to gather things in the 60 seconds that you had, you and your family, but this time it's you and your Astro buddies, and they're Astro hitting the Earth or something like that. I'm not sure I didn't. Oh, day one. Okay. Tom Thompson. <laughs> you look like a Tom Thompson. Let me guess. Oh, his name is Baby Bronco. Your name is like Beth something. Megan? She looks nothing like a Megan. All right. Uh, let's read the transcript. Day one. Hi, Astro. Computerized assistant reporting for duty. You must be Dee Dee, right? I'm... I'm not gonna do that. I'm pleased to announce that you've been randomly selected to become the captain of this vessel. Welcome aboard, this escape shuttle captain. On behalf of Astro Citizen Pilgrim. Okay, it's a robot properly, so I'm gonna read it in a robot voice. Please accept our apologies for the tiny inconvenience of being relocated 60 parsecs away from Earth. Recommended course. Hey Google, how far is a parsec? One parsec equals 1.917 times 10 to the 13 miles. Shoot. Recommended course of action. Find a safe place to land on, then try to contact the outside world. There is no outside world. It's been blown up. Jeez. Please check the main computer for further instructions. It's located on the center of the shuttle. Follow the regular rationing protocol to feed your crew. Good luck. You're going to need it, Captain. Oh God, choose category. Make seven successful after juice decisions of any type. Find an appropriate landing spot. Okay, that's good to know. Captain, since you've taken command and protocol, this dictates a speech must be given, a good one. Scratch that, a great one. Everyone is really looking forward to your speech. So am I, this is it. You can really show what kind of breed of captain you'll be on this incredible journey. What kind of speech would you give? Agility? Intelligence and strength. Intelligence. Check. Oh. Uh, I ended the day. Hopefully that's what I was supposed to do. I felt a little confused here. Day one. Day two, I'm sorry. You know exactly what to say. Your convincing speech was more than enough to preside, provide the word for the last game answer. It was a quiet performance, Captain. Your crew sat it cheering even before you finished the speech. Long live Captain. Sure, Captain. I really thought I could try to silence void outside the holding ship. That would be it. One thing's for sure. You are ready for the challenge the scattered throws at you. Tom. Tom's nice. Being reported glad to have you as his captain. Hmm. So Tom is the one with the thing stuck. Yeah. Hunger, okay. Sanity, okay. Morale, loyal. Should we feed him? I mean, he's not hungry. Okay. What is morale? Is that like, hey Google, what does morale mean? 
Here's the definition of morale. The confidence, enthusiasm, and discipline of a person or group at a particular time. Okay. Okay. Oh, she doesn't have any morale. I'm weak. All right. Captain, it's important to keep yourself and your crew well fed. One portion of this delicious canned soup will sustain a human for days. I doubt we'll find another useful rations. More in space is your sock unless you want to eat your own free. I think the first person we'll choose to eat is Megan. She seems the most thick. Look, look at those thighs. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look at everyone else though. They're like, they're like skinny. She's the one with the most meat on her bones. Soup. Best food in the universe. Crafting unavailable. System disabled. Can you come back later? Have a nice day. Alright, if we have to shoot someone, mm -hmm. it'll be Tom Thompson. He seems pretty, like, I don't know. We'll shoot him, though. What does that say? The human shrimp is willpower, but some muscle may also provide an outer space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's end this day. Oh, I can't. What the... Who perform a routine supply check? The only requirement is just simple mathematics. I realize it must be asking a lot, but I have a good feeling about this crew captain. Let's send Tom. Okay, let's not choose baby. I don't want, let's choose Tom. No, let's choose Megan. She seems like the person who has the most mathematical sense, I think. Megan, you're gonna go do the job. Goodbye. <laughs> Hopefully she's not dead when she comes back. Megan, are you there? I think Megan's dead. Oh, it's day three. <laughs> I thought Megan was dead. Okay, good news, Captain. The shuttle can pre-stock with emergency uh, use it use it well. What you mean, as well? The routine supply check is now complete and does not compute. An error was made that was got trusting humans to do math. Yeah, we probably shouldn't have chosen Megan. She doesn't seem the brightest. Yeah, so, like, come on. Who wears jewelry in space? Only Megan. Some crew supplies went missing in the current number of soup cans or the seven. With decent le decent leadership, it's rational restraint. The reserves of food on the ship will be sufficient for the time being. That being said, it's in your best interest to pursue this more to procure, procure as much as possible. Tom remains loyal. Awesome. So is Tom the only one that's loyal? Okay, I guess not. But everyone's pretty hungry, not hungry, right? Like everyone's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. That's good. That's good. All right, what do we have to do today? Captain, the crafting module's back in the cabin is now available. It's pretty self-explanatory to stay for the art machine. All right, let's try it out. Ooh. Let's craft soup. How do you do it? Is it crafting soup or what? I don't know. Oh, it has two things to craft. Or is it 20? I don't know. All right, I think we're good. Let's go ahead and end this day. Day four. Is that all? Oh, day four, like, is that all? Day four. Captain, I told you to activate the crafting system back to the shuttle. I thought it was simple enough to be operated. Perhaps I was wrong. Excuse me, robot. You aren't going to go taking over the earth because there's no earth left, okay? I did craft, I craft soup. Space travel can be dull, but there's still tons of ways to make your own fun. Trust me. I'll live in the computer. Let's design the game. Ooh. You'll leave a core mechanic which you resolve around the item. Get creative. What kind of game will you design? Shovel? Nothing. I guess I only option is shovel. I mean, we did bring a shovel. All right, everyone's not hungry. It's been four days. You guys should be starving. I guess they're good. They're okay. All right, are we playing games or what? I tried using a crafting machine and it doesn't do anything. I've tried crafting soup, doesn't do anything. 
Let's recycle this tape because we don't need it. See, I'm even gonna recycle it and it's still here. I don't get it. I've tried it. Okay, let's just end this day. Hopefully, I don't get snapped at by the freaking computer again. Idiot. Uh, are we all dead? There's the black I don't like this music. It's creeping me out. Day five. You design your game around the shovel. The current mechanics of your game was tag. You being the captain. You're always it. You chase the rest of the queue around the shuttle trying to smack them in the head. Oh, God. <laughs> Can you imagine playing? <laughs> you played to no one wanted to play with anymore. Still, the mute on the shovel was lighted. Tom is still loyal. Tom, my boy Tom. Crafting completed. New item available, soup. Oh, it did craft. Okay, you're now alert. You're hungry. Megan says she's glad to have you as a captain. Megan is hungry. Okay, we get it. Everyone's hungry. Let's eat. All right. Let's go ahead and eat. Let's feed soup to everyone. Wait, no. You eat. You eat. Go ahead and eat, baby. I don't mean it like that either. Let's go ahead and eat. I just fed you. How are you still hungry? She's still hungry. Still hungry. Huh. Still hungry. Mm -hmm. What if I press this? I don't want to. Huh. Mm. <laughs> okay. I, I guess the only changes are being made in, until after the day is up. I, you found a couple of rusted and swallowed cans of soup in the darkest part of the ship. Someone must have put it there a long time ago, and they completely hmm. forgot about it. It doesn't look all safe to eat, but then again, canned soup, it's supposed to last for 737 years. Okay, okay. Let me just break this down to you guys. You, uh, you've traveled. Hey, Google, how long is, how far is a par set? This is how far you traveled, okay? Come on. One parsec equals 1.917 times 10 to the 13 miles. If you travel that far in space, that is over probably 1 billion years. That can is old, so that soup is old, so we're not keeping that soup. No thanks. You're not going to kill me and my teammates out here. Not today. All right, guys, we're going to cut it on this day, which is day number six, I think. Yeah, day, day number six. Okay, so we're gonna stop here. The ancient suit was found look really old. I mean, it's like pyramids old. You threw it out and never looked back. Well, maybe you did once or twice. Probably not more than three times. Yeah, I was. I didn't plan on keeping that. Is anyone? Why are you still hungry? I fed you. You know, I'm not. I fed you. Why are you so hungry? I don't understand. Everyone is still hungry. <laughs> And we only have four cans of soup left. Aren't you guys happy? <laughs> Caffeinated alert. Hmm. Excuse me? Hmm. Anyway, I fed everyone. I've done all I can do. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, I've been doing 60 parsecs. I really didn't mm -hmm. understand uh, 60 seconds, but I guess as I watch tutorials and whatnot. Ooh, we can explore space. As I work, watch 60 seconds or um, whatnot, I kind of got it, kind of got it, I don't know. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Why is there a vent in the space shuttle in space? I'm not gonna go there. But I hope you guys have enjoyed. Make sure you guys leave a like. And as I said, this channel is about to as of Friday. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. I can't breathe.